Now at 11, an angry protest on a UC campus. An event featuring two controversial figures was forced to be canceled after police said it was just too dangerous. Good evening and thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Ama Dates. And I'm Dan Ashley. Tonight's protest happened at UC Davis. Conservative commentator Milo Yiannopoulos and pharmaceutical executive Martin Shkreli rather, were slated to speak on campus tonight. ABC 7 News reporter Katie Udis was in the middle of tonight's demonstrations and has our developing story. Katie. Amma, we witnessed so much passion, mistrust, and misinformation that some people didn't even believe that the event was canceled when it was announced. And people stood around and rallied for hours. Shut it down! Protesters blocked the doors. Police tossed them out. Nobody got inside, not even the Davis College Republicans headliner, conservative commentator Milo Yiannopoulos. We came here to have an event that would promote free speech and we didn't get to have any speech. The 400 free tickets went quick and not just to students. Brandon Tony James drove in from Sacramento. Milo is a rising young conservative star and I want to see him pretty much close in person. Others did not. Mostly with Milo, just how everything he has to say has to bring people down. It's not what we should stand for as a community, especially at Davis. Nearly 60 UC police officers worked to control the crowd, making one arrest for obstructing an officer and battery of a peace officer. Event organizers made the call to cancel. The students' lives were at risk. At a certain point, the officers' lives became to be at risk, and their school property became at risk. There was no point in having this if a single person got hurt. Pharmaceutical executive Martin Scarelli who was also scheduled to speak, made it to the venue. Milo is anti-feminism, I'm pro-feminism. I don't think these people know that. <laughs> um, they, uh, and I was going to tear Milo to shreds about, you know, his, he doesn't understand feminism. He took jeers from the crowd. You're wrong! And selfies with the curious. I think he's an interesting figure. How so? He's very controversial and a lot of his, uh, I mean, a lot of his opinions are very different than what people like. Meanwhile, Yiannopoulos posted that he's staying in Sacramento and invited people out. A university spokesman says no property was damaged during the protest. In Davis, Katie Udis, ABC 7 News. setting fire, smashing storefront windows, some fighting with police. Always be prepared, right? It's no fun if it's too easy. MacGyver, CBS Fridays.